Jennifer on lockdown was officially launched on the 13th of May 2021. Hey guys, welcome back to Sahara Movies. I'm Lydia and I'm your host for today. So we'll take a look at the first episode of Jennifer on lockdown. Yeah, he's been promote she's been promoting it for a while now, and finally I have seen it. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe for more videos and more updates. As usual, the series will not exclude the main character jennifer herself you know she's always playing the leading role in most of her series and she does well in playing or in portraying what she wants us to know i mean i think she feels that no one can replace her because she does a good job in expressing her comedy talent or her comedy skills in this one she finds ways and i mean in this episode she finds ways and means to teach or educate people about the virus yeah from the way the story from the focus of this series i realized i think production started in 2020 because basically it is focusing on the COVID-19 virus so I think production started in 2020 they just decided to or they decided to make hay while the sun shine because COVID was was raining at that time even though COVID is still in 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 existence um people still have this myth about COVID so Jennifer in her own talent or in her own ways decides to express um her way of conveying the message to us and i think the message was 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 well transferred or was well conveyed though we understand her niche as comedy we are able to know how serious she is in displaying her skills like she, she she's warning against the virus at the same time she's making it funny so she's she's killing two bears with a stone so i i like the the i like the channel of jennifer you know she's been directing most of her series and she does good you could see that she always wants her series to be on the top notch jennifer's diary has been running for the past years and it's still running and it's still something people watch just imagine the number of years over four years and people still watch because when you go on youtube you still find the series having crazy views and that's a good one if she had lost ideas in i think along the way like she wouldn't still be getting the audience that she has now so i feel she 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 she's doing well she's doing well now that she has started this one jennifer on lockdown let's see how the series will run through let's see how long it will be how many episodes and how many seasons definitely the 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 lesson or the story will convey the impact like it will tell us why um the idea came about and at the same time it will give us something to laugh with yeah something to laugh with i like the movie i wouldn't really I wouldn't really um, give a critical analysis of the acting because I know this is a comedy skit and I wouldn't expecting I wouldn't be expecting so much from um, from the actors and the actresses. I understand that this is a comedy something and I feel they did their best and yes just as jennifer's diary that has lots of audience i feel this one will also gain lots of audience if and when the same interesting person is followed till the series ends yeah till the series ends so the plot was to educate people on the virus we could see how she kept on um explaining to people who have different different perceptions about the virus right now the virus is is actually not the first thing we think about when we wake up rather than those times when it's we that as soon as we wake up that's the first thought but now it's actually maybe the second or sometimes never we don't even think about it anymore so this series i'm not really expecting um lot of people taking 
the advice into consideration because they are advices that people already know yes i hope you get what i'm trying to say because when covid came first people were a lot of us were searching for how to take care of yourself what are the drugs what are like a lot they were we were really searching for it i understand why jennifer also waited so long to upload this movie or this series or waited so long for the production team to finish this because they needed to be certain about the truth they needed to be certain about the facts because this is a worldwide something it's a pandemic and if you give wrong solution in your film what is the point in trying to educate the people who watch it and and also the people around so i understand why it took a while right now we are all very certain of the symptoms we are also very certain of um the fact that there are so many myths involved like we we i wouldn't say this came late i said this because of accuracy she had to i think she had to release the series a bit later after covid even though we are still in the covid area i'm um, sorry we are still in the covid era she released it a bit later after when we're in the peak season of covid still the same there's there are people out there who don't really know what's going on they know there's covid they know they're supposed to wash their hands and all that but what is the essence what is the essence so jennifer on lockdown is trying to teach viewers teach viewers you know when you're watching something and there's comedy in it it's most likely for the thing to stick because you are you'll be enjoying it you really be enjoying this and sometimes you might not take it serious but i think eventually because the precautions have been really repeated when we watch jennifer's diary we'll take the precautions into consideration yeah so i think it was good production was good acting was good yeah uh, for the acting i said earlier i wouldn't be expecting so much because it's comedy if it was um something like adventure or romance i'll be expecting the actresses to include a lot of emotions or something but this is comedy i wouldn't be expecting so much yeah let me put it that way i wouldn't be expecting expecting so much from the actors and actresses so yeah have you seen it have you seen it i think this is good this is good for jennifer to be this creative to do this i think she's done a good job she's done a good job so my opinion is the way the first episode was able to um like the first episode talked about just the basis of the virus let's see how the subsequent episodes will be like well let's go into detail how we know about um, what's really going on in some places of like there are some places that were affected by the virus or that were hit by the virus this is i think the first episode is just like orientation so we are going into to we are going into details what actually goes on or what actually went on during the peak season of covid yeah i like it i like the movie yeah and i also like one thing he was she was able to let us know that covid wasn't at only one aspect of the world like um she generalized that it's a pandemic yeah and also emphasized on the fact that covid can affect everyone whether you live in the village you live in a mansion you live in an estate anywhere you live it can affect you because she didn't only focus on the fact that people in the cities are the ones getting affected she actually went farther to a village a village that that's a good storyline i hope she keeps this up as well let me know what you think about it have you seen the first episode what are your general thoughts like me i think it's good i'm not expecting i'm not ex- hey what's happening today i'm not expecting so much from it since it's comedy i wouldn't be expecting top notch like emotions drama and all that i think it's okay not okay it's even underestimation i think it's good enough yeah so our idea for today if you are new to this channel kindly subscribe for more videos and more updates don't forget to like don't forget to comment don't forget to share till next time my name is lydia once again bye